hey, 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 Aries. This is your sacred scribe here ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, North Node. This won't resonate with everybody, but hopefully it does with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Aries, if you would before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Make sure you're clicking on that link as there are many tarot card impersonators out there. So also know that you will see my face in a reading if you order one from me, as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize. Uh, forever here on YouTube. So Aries, your overall energy is the Eight of Cups here. Well, the Eight of Moons, it's Cups. Uh, you have the Ace of Wands, the Page of Stars, the Empress, and the Hermit. Wow. So you're walking away from something, some, it's either a person, place, or thing. And I feel that you're going fast and there is going to be major ooh, major upheaval that's what they just said but i i feel like it's good it's it's good is it good it's good for you i don't know if it's good for whoever you're leaving behind but it's causing maybe because with the empress here i see you they're saying making strides so you're expanding wherever you're going let's see tell me about the eight of moons where are you what are you doing the hanged man the five of stars you don't like where you are page of moons which is the page of cups here You may go ghost on somebody or, you know, five of pentacles, which is, um, yeah, five of pentacles is leaving somebody out in the cold or feeling like you're left out in the cold. So either A, you're feeling this way and you've taken a step back, looked at different perspectives and you're like, I got to leave, right? Uh, or um, you're just leaving without saying anything with the five of pentacles okay so let's get a kipper on this mmm yeah I feel you're okay you're gonna be receiving a gift and it could be because of this gift it allows you to take action here wow okay could be a gift from the universe right or a gift from somebody tell me about the ace of wands the five of moons yeah there's a sadness you're leaving behind it could be a, a lover the eight of swords you've been all up in your head about this it may even be a twin for some of you what else yeah, the Five of Swords. Wherever you are, okay, whoever you're leaving behind here, there's like you've been battling, right? And it's a battle that nobody wins. You've been all up in your head about this, you know, sad about a past love relationship or love relationships. And now you're taking action towards what you want. Kippa. Yeah, community. So you may be actually moving. Okay. All right. So, whoops, page of stars. We have justice, the sun. Yeah, you're taking the opportunity to balance yourself out. I feel you've been holding on to dreams that you've been wanting to manifest. And you're preparing yourself for this because it's going to make you extremely happy with the sun. That's the happiest card in the deck. You're following your intuition here. Message of concern. And high honor. 
So I feel your vibration is rising. With this message of concern, I feel that's related to the Eight of Swords energy. When you are all up in your head, or you will be all up in your head. There may be things that are you're questioning. Should I, shouldn't I, should I, shouldn't I? I feel like that's you doing it to you. You know, questioning your desires or your, you know, soon to be action here. Tell me about the Empress. This is the Empress. Now, this could be that you're coming the fool. You could be taking a leap of faith, right? Either on a person, could be a Taurus or a Libra. Or you're taking a leap of faith on yourself and you're just expanding. The Nine of Stars, which is the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, and the Knight of Moons. I feel you're taking a leap of faith. Hmm. On yourself and possibly somebody. Okay. It's like you're taking your heart and you're leaving. Yep. Your path is lit up here. There's a lot of abundance on your path. That's what I'm hearing. Tell me about the hermit. We have the devil. We have the magician. And we have the king of wands. Okay. So you're shining a light upon the shadow aspects of the self. So you're going to leave something behind or someone. All right or people, because there's five of swords here, right, behind, to work on yourself. You're manifesting, okay, your power. You're taking your power back with the king of wands. With the devil card, this is looking at your patterns of behavior, okay, and understanding the balance. You know, it's integration of the shadow into the light here. Ooh, love message. So this love message may be the impetus that actually gets things going, or this is happening after you leave. But what is your advice here? The Four of Moons. Don't ignore opportunities that are being presented to you. King of Stars and Knight of Swords. Yeah. And Spirit's trying to tell you something. So you need to listen. And they're also saying you need to pay attention to... The King of Pentacles is grounded, right? Make sure that you're grounding. And make sure that you're comfortable. I'm getting comfortable. So this could be like material. Related to material gain. Keep yourself grounded as you go about this transformation, okay? That's what I'm getting here. All right, let me get... Let me get some advice here. Advice for Aries. Advice for Aries. What you got? Direction. Switch gears, reboot, and try a new and different direction. Yeah, so you're on the right path, Aries. So if you've been questioning it, don't. That's what I have for you. Like, share, subscribe below if you want a reading uh, and, and are interested. The link is in the description box. Uh, make sure you use that link as there are scammers about. And know that you'll always see my face in a reading as well as receive an unlisted link. Have a great day and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.